Hello today and we're going to have a game of the Dam Busters for the Commodore 64. I thought this was a good game back in the day. I actually owned it for the Amstrad first but I thought I'd do the Commodore 64 version because I honestly thought it played better but it was a harder game I thought. So what we've got to do, we've got to take off so we're going to put our boost right up. Oh my god. Ignore that and our engine's full up so now we're gonna I think this is the flaps Take the flaps down now the damage report so our engine burp, the map the dam the rear gunner the front gunner and we're in the cockpit so now we've got to wait till we get some speed up as we're going down the runway taking off or trying to take off Come on, up in a little bit, come you piece of shit, take off. Fuck it now, I'm still going for it, going, come on, you fucking heap of shit. Take off before we run out of runway. Got the engines right, oh, here we go. So now we've got to go up, now we've got to push six, and now we've got to bring our boost down. That's it, now we've got to bring our engines down a bit, so I don't overeat and blow up. Um, yeah, so that's basically what we do, and just get a little bit of that altitude going as we put our flaps back up, I think, and put our landing gear up, so we won't be needing that for a while, until we come back, if we come back. And as I say, this was a very hard, this was a lot harder on the Commodore 64 than it was for the Amstrad, but I thought it played better on the Commodore 64, but the Amstrad version wasn't bad. Not taking it anything away from the Amstrad. Um, so now we've got to set our waypoint, and so we're going to fly to the dam. So believe me, this is where we rest when we're flying over the channel. When we've flown over the channel and head into, I think, head into France, then down to Germany, you don't rest. That's it, your rest is over. Because you're constantly um, going back and forth from three or two. It's just um, shoot the fighters, the, um, the floodlight. Because if you get caught in the floodlight, they send and shoot flak. And they, hit you, and they could hit your plane and avoiding and shooting the barrage balloons. But as I say, I ain't said, but you know, if you go over over a certain altitude, you don't encounter the barrels balloons. But we just want to make this a little bit more fun. I know this was a hard game, but let's just go down a bit. Um, yeah, it's going to be a bit difficult to talk and <laughs> play this game at the same time, especially um, now. It's easy because when we're flying, we don't do nothing when you're flying over the channel. Sit there, just have a rest before we encounter the enemy. Because that's there we go. We're going to be in France so anytime soon. So this is where the fun begins. Don't worry, it does get it does get exciting. This game. So here we go. We're on the on it now. So we're going to shoot the floodlights. Now there's a plane behind us as well. So quickly push three, push two, push three, push this. That's all we're going to be doing. Oh, we caught the floodlights, so there's a plane behind us as well. Well, no, it's a floodlight. That's the plane is coming. It is, as I say, it's a lot easier on the Amstrad. You don't encounter everything at once, like all you, you do on here, but it makes it more real, I suppose. So here comes a barrage balloon. So we've got to shoot these barrage balloons, because you hit one of these bad barrage balloons, it's game over, the plane crashes. So get these spotlights in order to get the barrels blown, fuck it. You know, there's a plane behind, but we just, we can't, we ain't got time to, to um, do three. We just got to shoot to get to, there's only fighters, the fighters come behind. So we will be more worried about what's in front of you. Oh! So we did hit by a flag, or we just find the spotlight. So it comes barrels below, so fucking, I mean, this game is really intense. I mean, you're never, you're not stopping doing nothing. You're just constantly, constantly firing at things. 
you've got to worry about your, like, your plane catches, like your engines catching fire or something, then you've got to go to number six and turn them off. Oh, bloody hell, there's something behind us, but we're not worried about that. We can't. We can't do everything. Um, this would make a good two player game, actually. If you play two players, like one could fly the plane, one does the front, fire in and the rear. That would make it more exciting if you could play two players like that. Or even three players. Um, that would make it exciting, this game. Everyone's involved. But unfortunately you can't. So we're all right, we're checking these. Yeah, everything's fine. I'm just trying to look for damage control there, but don't worry about it. No, yeah, it's damage control, so nothing's damaged. It's good. So, there we go, floodlights, we didn't get that, we get all the floodlights, shit. The plane behind us, so we can't do nothing, we can't, we can't do too much at once. Oh, god, shit, shit, number six, number six, push number six. Shit, our oh, number three engine's down, so switch the engine off before it catches fire. Ah, oh, fuck, so we're running on three engines now. See, I told you this game, <laughs> you can't rest one minute with this game. Another fight, oh, fucking hell. Come on, Vic, miss the fucking spotlight. Ah, oh, shit. Power's blown, fucking hell. We just saved the time to use the rear gunner, so... More, more important was ahead of us, not behind us. But mind you, the fighters can damage your plane, so... Come on, fucking hell. Getting hit by flak, everything. Fucking hell. More fucking fire. Come on, let's go. Whoa. Shit. Come on. Fucking too much going on. <laughs> it is a difficult game to play. We've got a barrage balloon. Just hit the barrage balloon. Just hit the eyes of the car. <laughs> you can't rest for one minute. I honestly feel sorry for those guys who did the bombing raid. Bloody hell. Here's a map, so... Why are we flying down there? We're flying, flying off course. So we can't... can't even look to... Here we go. Probably the reason why, because we, won't, we have to adjust the trim. Because one of our engines are out, so... Oh, see, we ain't got time to fucking fly the plane. We've got to fire at the bloody barrels. Barrels balloons. They're a fucking spotlight. You just ain't got time to rest. Right, let's get the plane in, in line with the red thing, so that, that's well the waypoint where that red line is. We'll just worry if we see any barrage balloons, then we'll have to go to the gunner. Oh, oh dear, get the spotlight, fuck it, we've got our plane in line. But as I say, we've got to adjust the trim. Looks like we adjust the trim. <laughs> okay, oh. The game is intense. Oh fuck, we ain't got a rear gunner who's been shot. That's fucked. Oh dear. So now we've lost our rear gunner. <laughs> now, engine 3 out, so and rear gunner. Don't say that, but we know that. Bloody hell. I mean, this game's bad enough. Trying it. Well, it ain't bad, I don't mean bad, I mean intense. Imagine doing this for real. Cut. We're just moaning because it's a computer game. Shit, no, we can't do that. We can't do nothing, it's been shot. Um Yeah. So that oh fuck now, six, six, four, for six. Um engine one is out. Fucking hell. We've got two engines out, so that should balance it out now. We've got one engine each side is out. So no, that will way off course again. Shit. We're flying on two engines. Luckily this is a four engine Lancaster, so... I mean... <laughs> so it's obviously going to slow us down now because we're running on two engines. Get the bloody thing straight. Oh, bloody hell. This is a tough game. Really a tough game. I mean, we could have started doing a bombing run. Uh, started on the channel, but I wanted to make this game, I like this taking off, you know, make the game a bit more thrilling, it's not thrilling enough, 
Go get the bloody thing. Ah! Get hit by a flak. And the barrage balloon. You've got to get those barrage balloons. So our plane's in a very bad state by now. Only flying on two engines. Ooh. It's gotta be on it. Can't do nothing. The battery's been shot, so can't do nothing. Bloody hell. I could never do the bombing lines. Bloody hard the bomb the, the dam. Shooting the bombing the dam, bombing the dams. Quite difficult. Lucky if I can get there in one piece, let alone do the bombing. Come on, fuck! Missed it. Oh, barrel's blown. Jesus. Oh, one, and light, height lights out. Shit. So that must be the uh, dam. Is that the dam lights? I don't know. So we're probably going to be pretty screwed when we get there. There's too much going on. Bloody hell. Get in. Gonna get to Oh fuck no! Engines out, engines out. What one's at the number two engines out? Fuck. We're flying on one engine. Oh bollocks, so that's gonna slow us down even more. Bloody hell, I hope the other engine don't go out, be yeah, up here all day. Oh shit rough course. Oh fuck, oh no, no, I can't, yes. Jesus Christ, my little turn. Shit, we're flying on. Look out, look, we're going so slow now, I've only got one engine. Shit. Surprise me, I'll stall the plane in a minute. Oh no, there's a barrage balloon, but straight her up. Come on, push number two. Shit, it's coming too fast. Oh fuck! That's it, it's game over. We're going down for a nose dive because we are totally lost control of the plane. The plane just crashes now. So we're dead. As we plummet to our death, really. <laughs> Jump out the fucking plane. That's it, we're going to crash. And that's the end of the review. Hope you enjoyed it. Till next time, goodbye.